In the last hour, Citadel cadets held their weekly parade, but today's honored the college's diversity milestones, the welcoming of African American and women cadets to their campus. Sydney Ryan explains how these breakthroughs helped shape the former all-male military college. Every week, Citadel cadets march in a parade. Today, it has a theme. This one is going to be in dedication of the two milestones. The Citadel celebrates 20 years of women in the South Carolina Corps of Cadets and 50 years of African Americans. I think it's a, a, a great uh, achievement, a great uh, milestone for, for not just the Citadel, but uh, for, for everyone around the nation. It's a great accomplishment uh, to show that, uh, that anyone can do this. Diversity is, is everywhere. Um, there's cadets in all different kinds of positions. The first to break the ground, Charles Foster and Nancy Mace, did not have the easiest transition. I cannot thank enough the first uh, African Americans who had confidence in us to come and to break new ground. And the women that first attended, uh, they took on tough jobs. I'm glad that they paved the way for me to be here. The past they created are an inspiration for future cadets. It shows that the, the, the country as a whole is uh, moving forward and uh, breaking uh, breaking boundaries. I'm just really excited that we can all kind of hold whatever rank we want. We have to earn it and we, we're held to the same standard, but I think we're doing good things here. Those paths have helped staff as well, including Book, the first ever female provost at the Citadel. When we have uh, isms in our world, whether that's racism or sexism, uh, thinking about breaking new ground in that. Uh, it's a real privilege to be a first. The Citadel will continue to honor and celebrate these milestones through the rest of the academic year. Reporting from Summerall Field, I'm Sydney Ryan, Live 5 News. Thank you, Sydney. The commemorations will continue next Friday with a Women Cadet and Alumni Networking Luncheon. For more information on all of those events at the Citadel, you can head over to our website, live5news.com.